Hi guys, today we are going to be looking at the new event deck for Modern and I was really excited by this deck uh, when it first came out that they were going to do event deck but this is uh, beyond atrocious. This is one of the, I mean I don't understand how anyone can take this deck and do well in a tier, you know, in a competitive format. Uh, lands, you have 24 of them, you have 4 Caves of Colossus, 2 City of Brass, 4 Isolated Chapels. I mean the chapels are pretty nice, I do like them. Five planes, four swamps, one vault of the archangel, and four wind brisk heights, which is not a bad card. But creatures, you have two soul wardens, you have two tide hollow scholars, so the creatures are not extremely valuable. Uh, other spells, honor the pure, inquisition, intangible virtue, lingering soul, path to exile, which is kind of nice, raise the alarm, shrine, spectral procession, sword and feast and famine, only one of those, uh, zealous prosecution, else by Knight Errant, just one of those. And uh, your sideboard is not great either. You have Kotaku Wars Wades, uh, Relic of Progenesis, Ghost Quarter, Dorez, Dismember, Quartz Tender. Uh, there was a lot of stuff that they could have done to make this a better deck. Um, they chose not to. I really don't see anyone buying this for $75. I feel like it is uh, MSRP being $75. That's very, very expensive for this type of deck. And you already had pre-sales of over a hundred dollars for the event deck and unfortunately this is not even worth in my opinion it's not worth the price tag it's not worth the hype i have no idea what they are doing uh, they obviously could have put in some marsh flats they could have added more elspeths um, this is actually not even a deck this is not a tier one deck it's not a tier two deck uh, it's not even a junk deck it's a deck that if you took to a competitive event you would get blown out completely. So uh, very disappointing and unfortunately this is how magic is right now.